Hi, and welcome to another Ping Plotter Cloud tutorial. My name is Tyson. I'm a customer success engineer here at Pingman Tools. And today, I'm going to teach you how to export some of your Ping Plotter data to a spreadsheet. Let's start with why you would even want to do this in the first place. You may find yourself wanting to do a more detailed overtime analysis than what you can see using the timeline graph. Maybe your service provider wants to see numbers rather than a pretty Ping Plotter graph. I've heard it before. Or maybe you want to see the data in a slightly different form, like a bar chart. By downloading your ping plotter statistics to a spreadsheet and manipulating the data in a program like Excel, you'll have a lot more freedom with how your data is presented. There are two types of exports. The first will export the summary statistics that you see in the trace graph up here. This can be done for a single target, all targets for a single agent, or a custom summary. I'll do one for my Raspberry Pi agent. Select the time frame by adjusting the visible time in the timeline graph below. You can hone in on a specific time frame within the timeline graph by using a focus period. Just double click. Notice how the statistics change as I adjust my focus period. To export the summary statistics, click on the share button at the top of the page next to the agent name and select Statistics Excel Format. Your download will begin immediately. The second export is the Statistics Over Time Export. This allows you to export the same data you saw in the summary export, but now over a period of time rather than a quick snapshot. This can be extremely helpful if you want to compare how a target was performing over different time periods. To start, select your target, click the share button at the top of the page, and select export statistics over time. These two buttons here allow you to quickly select all of the data you've collected, or just the data that was visible in the timeline graph. You also have the ability to manually adjust the start date and end date of your export using these options. The data grouping size adjusts how your data is aggregated. For a more granular analysis, select a smaller grouping. You can get as low as 5 minutes. For a quick overview, select a larger group like a day or a week. You can also choose to have the data exported in your local time zone or in the UTC time zone. When you think you've got it set up the way you want, hit the preview button. The preview will be available below. Notice how each day is one row. This corresponds to the grouping size I selected above. If this doesn't look like the way you want it, make your adjustments and hit the preview button again. When you've got it just right, select either export to Excel or CSV. Your file will download immediately. Open this in your favorite tool and chart away. In this video, I taught you how to export your summary statistics and your statistics over a period of time. I hope this feature allows you to further analyze your ping plotter data. If you find creative ways of manipulating your data, let us know. Send us an email, leave us a comment, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and as always, happy pinging.